Well, Bob, the day is finally here. As much as we wish it wasn't, the legacy you are leaving with this community is immeasurable, and there is no way we'll be able to replace you. Your accomplishments and the many lives you have touched over your three plus decades of service are too many to count. Honestly, if we listed them all, we'd be here for hours, and you might even fall asleep like you did on a few occasions in your office after a long commission meeting. Okay, okay, in all seriousness, you have cared so much about this community. I'm reminded of a day back in 2018 when the City Hall AC broke in the middle of summer. Despite sweltering conditions in the 90s, I came in the office and there you were, all smiles and working on behalf of the citizens of Deland. That is true and unconditional love. And in many ways, the love that you have given will never be fully reciprocated as that is the life of a public servant. But over the next few minutes, a small fraction of the people you have encountered, and some you have not, will say thank you for your dedication to Deland. Personally, Bob, thank you for not only being a great mayor and leader, but thank you for your friendship. There's not many people who get to say that the mayor went to their wedding, and I loved introducing you to Piper. I'll miss our many conversations about sports and you giving me a hard time about supporting Michigan and wearing my polo every Friday. But most of all, I'll miss walking by your office and seeing you there. In truth, you'll always be mayor in our hearts. Thank you, Bob, and I hope you enjoy this video. Mayor Bob, I'm so grateful for your friendship, mentorship, and the kindness that you've shown me over my 22 years with the city of Deland. You've always been Deland's biggest champion, not just for what we are, but for the ideas you put forth to sustain our success into the future. You have championed so many great projects and programs over the years that I'm sure others will mention. However, it is that desire and tenacity to always be on the cutting edge and to challenge us all to do better and to be better. I can say that without a doubt that working with you all these years has been a privilege and honor of a lifetime. I will miss our quick chats and idea sessions that lasted longer than five minutes, by the way. So now I just have two things for you. One, set a good example in your retirement and enjoy the well-deserved time off enjoying all the things that you love and had to sacrifice because of the commitments that you made as mayor. Second, thank you for your service and for making Deland a great place in which to live, work, and play. Enjoy your retirement, Bob. Bob, I just want to say congratulations on your well-deserved retirement as mayor of delightful Deland. It's been an honor to serve with you for 21 years, and you should have an immense amount of pride looking around at the city and seeing all the things that you've had a hand in. The city hall that we're in, the police department, Speck Martin, Melching Field, our, our delightful downtown, all the awards we've won. You've had a hand in all of that. And it's been amazing to have you as our mayor, your passion, your dedication, and everything that you've done for the city. I just want to say thank you for making Deland a great place to live, work, and play. Enjoy your well-deserved retirement. Bob, it's been a pleasure to serve with you on the commission. Uh, so you've been uh, driving uh, this bus for, uh, for a long time now, and uh, I'm happy that you're taking some time for yourself to be with your family. We're going to miss you, but wish you the best of luck, and uh, we'll keep uh, rooting for all your sports teams too. So have a great time in retirement. Mayor Apgar, it has been a pleasure to serve on the left side of you because you are my right-hand man, and I'm going to miss you so much. The knowledge that you have bestowed upon me is irreplaceable. Happy retirement and God bless you. Bob, I wanna say thank you. Thank you for being such a dedicated leader in our community. I appreciate the opportunity to serve by your side, to learn from your example and from your friendship. I hope you enjoy your retirement and we're going to miss you. Hey Bob, well I'm here at Speck Martin Stadium, one of those big projects that we all worked on for the community, both for Stetson University and Deland High School. As I've had an opportunity the last couple months to really drive around Deland, from the north to the south, to the east and the west, 
looking at all the things that you have helped guide us through for these 31 years. Thank you, Bob. We have Freedom Playground. I was there yesterday and there were over a hundred kids on a Sunday afternoon. We have the upgrade of Melching Field. We have the amphitheater at Earl Brown Park. Who better fitting to have this whole entire complex named after than the Apgar Sports Complex? Thank you, Bob. Everything that you've done, you've led us to and guided us through will be here for generations and generations. And we have pickleball now. We're both going to be retired, so uh, maybe we can play some pickleball. Good luck. Enjoy your retirement. And thank you again for everything. Mayor Apgar, thank you so much for all the years of dedicated service, not only to the city, but the people of DeLand. You've been an inspiration to so many over so many years, myself included. I hope I can at least come close to being the example that you were for our community. Cheers and congratulations. Well, Bob Apgar, it is absolutely my pleasure to come out of retirement today to congratulate you on all your years as the mayor of our beautiful city of DeLand. And as, and as you move into your retirement. I can frankly say that the success of Stetson University was always based on the success of the city of DeLand and our partnership together. So I wanna thank you for that. I wanna wish you smooth sailing. I wanna wish you good health and joy in your retirement, an occasional win for Davidson, but much more rooting for Stetson University. Take care. Mayor Robert Apgar, how can we possibly thank you in a reasonable way for all that you have done for our community? You've had such an extraordinary career and we are especially grateful here at Stetson University for the close partnership we have had with the city of DeLand since 1883. Thank you and we wish you the very, very best in retirement. Go Mayor Apgar, go Hatters! Hey Bob, it's the Beckers, and we want to wish you a wonderful, happy retirement. You did wonderful things for DeLand, and we're very grateful for that. Yes, and thank you very much for all the help and support you gave us at Main Street. You were instrumental in helping us put feet on the street and making uh, Main Street one of the best in the whole country. Thank you. You did a great job trying to incorporate partnership of the city with the community, and that will never be replicated like you did. Thank you very much. Have a great retirement. Congratulations, Bob. I wish you all the best in retirement. I know you leave a huge legacy and that your mark will be all over the city of DeLand, but you also leave a legacy with me personally, and that is how to negotiate a contract in a friendly, detailed manner, right down to remembering to turn out my lights when I leave the office. Thank you for your friendship and your mentorship throughout my career, and I wish you all the best and much enjoyment in your retirement. Hi, Bob. You know, over the past 30 years, I've, I've watched you honor and congratulate members of our community for their achievements and, um, you know, over the, over the many years, and uh, now it's our turn to do that for you. And, you know, it's hard to imagine the city commission without you as, as their leader without you on it. But I know that over the years, you've mentored a number of commissioners and, and all the civic leaders. And I think as a result, the land's gonna be in good hands. Um, I've certainly enjoyed working with you and in all my years in the land, and, and you've, you've really empowered the employees and made us feel like part of the team and, and uh, really uh, we're a great leader in that respect. Um, you always took the high road and you, you brought all of us with you. And you know, I'd like to quote our old friend, Wayne Sanborn. He always said that you were smarter than your average bear. And I, DeLand could always count on you to see a few chess moves ahead. And uh, we, we really appreciate that, uh, that leadership and that, uh, that intelligence that you brought to the commission. And, you know, I've worked, I've, I've watched you over the years, over decades, make, make a lot of good decisions. And I know that it didn't come easily. You studied the issues very hard and you, and you agonized over the decisions to make the, make the right ones for DeLand. And above all, you know, I think you've embodied what Wayne Sanborn called good government. You've always stood for that in the land and you've been very successful. So let me join the others in thanking you for all your service to the city and for being a good friend. And we wish you a very happy and prosperous retirement. Good luck, Bob.
Hello, Bob. Congratulations on over three decades of successful leadership for the city of the land. As I was thinking back on my time as city manager from 1999 to 2009, uh, I was thinking of the characteristics that you displayed. Well, one, strategic long-term leadership. A good example of that's downtown redevelopment. Started under Mayor Rigsby and, and Wayne uh, and continued under you and, and continues this day. Just absolutely amazing the success that the city has had in downtown. And that largely because of strategic leadership from the city commission and followed by the, by the implementation of city staff. Uh, also, uh, consider one thing, the second thing that I would say is team building. Uh, you're right now facing another hurricane. In 2004, uh, we had three hurricanes back to back, and our success in those hurricanes was largely because we had a strong leadership of city commissioners and city staff that were able to coordinate activities and work together to solve what problems we ran into. The last thing, Bob, I'd say is service above self, the old rotary motto. Uh, that is you. Uh, from, from the charities that you've sponsored to just absolutely individual day-to-day uh, -day charitable uh, activities that you, you implemented as mayor. Uh, congratulations again on your leadership. The city is an absolute fantastic, better place because of your service to the city. The Athenian Oath. We will never bring disgrace on this our city by an act of dishonesty or cowardice. We will fight for the ideals and sacred things of the city both alone and with many. We will revere and obey the city's laws and will do our best to incite a like reverence and respect in those above us who are prone to annul them or set them at naught. We will strive unceasingly to quicken the public sense of civic duty. Thus, in all these ways, we will transmit this city not only, not less, but greater and more beautiful than it was transmitted to us. Bob, it's only fitting that the longtime mayor of the city known as the Athens of the South has fulfilled the Athenian Oath. I consider you a friend, mentor, and colleague, and wish you the best in your well-deserved retirement. Thanks so much for reaching out to me as a newly elected mayor and also for all the mentoring you've done of others for all these years. Have a great retirement. Hey Bob, it's been great serving alongside you as uh, the neighboring city of D-Land. Uh, you've done a fabulous job for your citizens. I also want to thank you for helping me with all things uh, that have to do with the Volusia League of Cities, the Florida League of Cities, the Florida League of Mayors and so forth. You've been very helpful and I've kind of always looked up to you as sort of as a mentor and the citizens uh, of D-Land will sorely miss you. So best of luck on your retirement. See you later, bye. Mayor Abgar, if ever there was a mayor emeritus, it would be you. Uh, thank you for your long years of service to D-Land, to Volusia County, to so many great causes. Certainly you've been a role model to me as a mayor and to so many others. I'm wishing you the happiest and greatest of retirements. Uh, you've ascended and taken the land to new heights, and I'm hopeful that the city will continue to evolve into the great place that it is. Again, congratulations, enjoy your retirement, and thanks for all that you've done. I just want to give a heartfelt congratulations to my good friend Bob Apgar, the wonderful mayor of the city of DeLand on a well-deserved retirement. I appreciate Bob, all the things that we've been able to do together to collaborate on issues to help move our communities in Volusia County floor, forward. And uh, uh, I look forward to being able to continue to work on some of the things you've started in the years to come as uh, we have really, really owe you a lot here in Volusia County uh, for the things that you've done, not just in DeLand, but for all of us. Have a terrific retirement, Bob. You deserve it more than anybody. Take care, my friend. Mayor Apgar, wishing you all the best in your future endeavors. And I really would like to thank you for your leadership and your collaboration in West Volusia and the elected officials round table, which were very big shoes to fill after your four years of amazing leadership and for your knowledge that you've imparted upon me and my colleagues with the Florida and Volusia League of Cities. All the best. Great cities don't happen by accident. It takes strong, stable, forward-thinking leadership. And Bob, you have uh, supported the downtown and the Main Street program, and it's resulted in a thriving, authentic, 
award-winning downtown that has served this community well. Uh, Bob, you benefited all of Deland with your service. Congratulations on your retirement and thank you for your service. Hey Mayor, it's Georgia Turner with the West Felicia Tourism Office and I just want to thank you for everything you've done for tourism within the last few years. I also want to brag on you a little bit because when we were hosting the preservation on Main Street a couple of months ago, all of the Main Street directors wanted a mayor like you. They just love how you are so supportive of Main Street, how you're supportive of tourism, how you're supportive of all the different initiatives in our area. And we really, really appreciate this. I really appreciate you for thinking regionally and really supporting West Volusia in the way that you have for within the last couple of years. I know it's not the last that we'll see of you, but I really do wish you a very happy retirement. Bob, thank you very much for your leadership over the last 20 years. The job you and the commission have done is incredible, making the land what it is today. And I wish you all the best in your retirement and look forward to seeing you around town. Hey, thank you so much, Mayor Apgar, for supporting all of our downtown businesses here in Deland. Mayor Apgar, congratulations on your retirement. You've meant so much to this community, and we look forward to seeing what you do in your next chapter. Hi, Bob. Congratulations on your retirement. Thank you for everything you have done for Lake Strong and for the community. We love you and are so happy for you on your retirement. This, this one's for you. Cheers, Bob. Mayor Bob, thank you for all the support, kindness, and mentoring you have given me over the years. I greatly appreciate your help and your recommendation to get me into United States Military, Military Academy, along with the assistance you gave myself and Eagle Scouts all over the city. Thank you, may God bless you, and enjoy your retirement. From all of us at the West Volusia Beacon, thank you, Bob. Happy retirement. All of us in admin services. Thank you and happy retirement. On behalf of the Deland Police Department. Thank you all happy retirement. On behalf of Admin Health Deland. Thank you Mayor Abdor and happy retirement. for the finance department. Thank you, Mayor, for all your years of service to the city of the land. Happy, Happy retirement. retirement. On behalf of the HR department. Thank, Thank you, Mayor Bob. Happy retirement. Thank you, Bob. Happy retirement. On behalf of the Parks and Recreation Department. We want to take this opportunity to thank you for all your many years of service to the city of the land. Your support of the Parks and Recreation Department over the years has been tremendous, and we are incredibly grateful. Congratulations! Thank you for supporting us, Bob! Yeah. Happy retirement, Bob! On behalf of public services, thank, thank you, Bob, Bob and happy retirement. retirement. On behalf of the congregation of the First Assembly, the Land Church, we want to take this time, this is just a small part because we have ministry ongoing throughout this campus. Mayor Robert Apgar, you've been a friend at First Assembly. You've been a friend to the, the congregation community in this church. You've called on us, we've called on you. We've worked together in a very powerful way. Borrowing something from the YMCA for the last 150 years is a triangle to reach people in spirit, soul and body and together we're able to do that we wish you the best as you retire we have mixed emotions you've served this city for over 30 years as a mayor over 20 years and now you're retiring we know you have an incredible family wife grandchildren we want you to enjoy them but we also want you to know that god isn't finished with you yet and that the next chapter of your life might go at a different speed but it's not going to build less in purpose. We bless you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, you and your family. We love you. We care for you. And we will remain available to you. And everybody said? Amen. Amen. God bless you. Hi, Bob. Congratulations on your illustrious career as mayor. I don't know much about being a mayor, but I certainly know a lot about coaching. 
and you would have been a great coach as well. You've always handled your responsibilities with great honor, integrity, and respect for all that you represented. Everyone became better because of your leadership. Thank you for that. Congratulations, happy for you, enjoy retirement. I've always had a great deal of respect and admiration for my much older brother, Bob. Uh, and Bob, you know it, I mean, you were great, you were a great big brother and you're a great uh, friend to me growing up and, and uh, I enjoyed watching you play sports and coaching baseball and just uh, growing up with your family and, and being part of the Apgar family. I've always been proud to be able to say I was your much younger and little brother. Hey, Graham Bob, thank you so much for uh, everything that you've done for the city. Thank you for what you've done for me. Um, I don't think that I could have uh, gotten this far without you. You're the best. Uh, thank you, Graham Bob, for everything you've done for us, uh, for taking me in when I was six and everything. Um, I love you. Thank you for everything. Hi, Graham Bob. Congratulations. We wish we could be there to celebrate your 21 years as mayor. We love you, and I've always been really proud to be able to say that my grandpa is mayor. Dad, we love you, we're proud of you, and it's really hard for me to believe that when you were first elected, I was younger than any of your grandkids. Congratulations. We love you, Grandbob, and you'll always be mayor Grandbob to me. Hi, Bob, I'm so glad that you've done such a wonderful job as mayor. I would expect nothing less, but you've really went out of your way to make sure the community of DeLand felt like they were. I'm so proud of what you've done in DeLand. It's, you've gone above and beyond the call of duty to make sure DeLand is a great place to live. But I'm really looking forward to your retirement so you can relax and we have good times and my grandchildren are looking forward to seeing you more.